They met eight years ago on MySpace, already sharing a passion for the Penguins when a road trip to Philadelphia changed everything. And then the friend that invited us backed out. So we ended up going on a whim, which is kind of what started all this, and the friend that invited us didn't even end up going. And that was only a month and a half after we yeah. first met. It was a new experience for Amy Bala and Pat McManus of North Huntington, being on the road with hockey's black and gold. Experiencing the game from a different view, not being surrounded by Penguin fans, but being one of a few Penguin fans. Thus began a quest to see the Penguins at every road venue, from Music City to Montreal. They even got engaged away from home and made friends both off and on the ice. It's like the team kind of starts to know you. They see you and they see you with your sign. Uh, like Dupuy, he'd come by and tap his stick on the glass at me when he saw me. Uh, Sid knows me on a first name basis. Uh, Flurry knows us pretty well. Yeah, he says he always sees us in the yeah. stands. And not even a snowstorm could stop their trip to the arenas of Western Canada. I woke up the next morning and said, why don't we drive to Philly, fly from Philly to Seattle, and then drive from Seattle to Vancouver. Uh, and in the end, it ended up being a 21-hour travel day. Tonight, that eight-year journey ends in Ottawa. But what has been forged is a relationship and a lifelong friendship. If you think about it, a month into our relationship, we started traveling. And I think you get to know somebody pretty well when you travel with them. That is true. And here are Amy and Pat this morning in Ottawa. They sent us this photo. They were guests at the Penguins morning skate, invited by goaltender Mark Andre Fleury. In honor of tonight's milestone of seeing the Penguins play in all 29 road venues in the National Hockey League. Andrew Stocky, Pittsburgh's Action News 4.